On Friday, Kylie Jenner shared a makeup-free video clip in her Instagram stories, flaunting her long locks. The brunette recently had a more shoulder-length cut, but in the video, Jenner's new hair trailed down the front of her dark brown tank top. She moved her head around to show off the wavy curls, winking at the camera and making a kissy face. She appeared to have taken the video while sitting on an airplane, wearing a fluffy blanket across her lap. Over in the video, she wrote in a corner, Missed this long hair. It's possible that the video is older and Jenner is reflecting on her past hair though, but she may have gotten extensions to bring back the more dramatic locks. In a photo taken on March 21, the Kardashian star had longer hair. She may just be feeling nostalgic. In a recent TikTok video, the Kelly Cosmetics founder said, Oak, I'm going to try to recreate my 2017 glam. She began by making her eyebrows as bold and as dark as possible, with an archived Kelly Cosmetics Kybro kit claiming, I think I killed it, after finishing the look. The rest of the makeup palette required dark brown eyeshadow with contouring, lots and lots of concealer, bronzer, loose translucent powder, bright blush, eyelash extensions, mascara, and a liquid lipstick and pencil to emphasize her full lips. This was really like a therapeutic experience for me and brought me back to such an amazing time in my life, Jenner said of the experiment. She also recently modeled bubblegum pink hair for the pop mag, throwing back to an era where she wore brightly colored hair with frequent changes. Of course, since 2017, a lot has changed for Jenner, who has welcomed two children, Stormy and Air, also expanded from her beauty empire to clothes, perfume, and a new vodka soda drink. Kim Kardashian, Kylie Jenner, and Gwyneth Paltrow count themselves among microdermabrasion's most famous fans. The stars, all of whom boast huge platforms where they share their favorite beauty products to millions of followers, have lauded at home microdermabrasion products as part of their skincare routines. But dermatologists say the real benefits come from expert-conducted microdermabrasion procedures, which can go a bit deeper into the skin, per the American Academy of Dermatology Association. Microdermabrasion is a gentle form of skin exfoliation. It's used to treat several skin issues, including uneven tone and texture and scars, including ones from acne, according to a scientific review published last year in Staperl's Publishing. That works to brighten, smooth, and improve the appearance of dullness, fine lines, wrinkles, texture, and mild discoloration, Dermatologist Dr. Lindsay Zabritsky tells USA Today, the process helps to shed and remove older, dead, dull skin cells on the top layer of the skin in order to reveal younger, brighter skin cells. It's been around since the 80s when dermatologists introduced it as a less aggressive alternative to harsher skincare treatments like chemical peels and dermabrasion for the 2023 review. The procedure involves a handheld vacuum system propelling abrasive crystals against the skin, the review added. This removes a layer of the skin, which then improves the skin's appearance when it heals. Results from microdermabrasion are typically immediate, Zubritsky says, adding that there's usually little to no downtime. Studies have shown that microdermabrasion techniques are safe for all skin types and have minimal complications. Minor side effects, according to the Cleveland Clinic, including bruising, discoloration, dry skin, and increased sensitivity to sunlight. Kylie Jenner and Timothy Chalamet's relationship seems to be facing challenges as the two celebrities navigate their busy schedules with Chalamet's involvement in the successful Dune 2 film and Jenner's focus on her new ventures. As Jenner promotes her recently launched vodka seltzer line Sprinter, Chalamet is deeply engrossed in filming the new Bob Dylan biopic, causing their time together to decline. They're hardly together anymore. One might even say they're on a break. Their lives got busy and they drifted apart. Of course, once their schedules quiet down, that could all change, revealed a source to In Touch magazine. Despite the distance, the insider emphasized that there are still feelings between them, leaving open the possibility of reconciliation when their schedules permit. However, it remains uncertain whether they will resume their relationship or move on. The couple went public with their relationship in September 2023, when they were spotted displaying affection at Bianca's concert. Earlier, another source shared insights into Chalamet's perspective, suggesting that the actor is wary of his personal life overshadowing his professional achievements. Timothy didn't like all the attention he got from the Golden Globes, the source explained. His career is taking off, and he wants to protect it and let it thrive based on his talent now and who he is or isn't dating. He also wants to protect his relationship with Killy, they added.